Hi, in this video we'll ask, can we simply say that the standard deviation is the mean of the deviations from the mean? Or is that an oversimplification? First, let's start with something we can all agree on. The standard deviation measures how far values typically deviate from the mean. Okay, but what does that mean now? And what does typically mean? Let's say we have six people and we measure the height of all of them. So first one is 173, the second 147 and so on and so forth. The standard deviation measures how far values typically vary from the mean. So we need to calculate the mean of our data first. In our case the mean is 155. By definition, greater spread around the mean means a larger standard deviation and less spread means a smaller standard deviation. Now, after calculating the mean, we can calculate the deviation of each person from the mean. So, the first person deviates 18 from the mean, the second 6 and so on and so forth. Now we can ask the question, is the standard deviation really just the mean of the deviations from the mean? In our example that would mean that the standard deviation is just the mean of this data. So we simply calculate the mean of these six values. Okay, before you skip this video because you think, well, the answer is so obvious, the answer to this question is both. Yes and no. Let's first look at why this statement is obviously wrong and then we'll see the reasoning behind why some people, including me, also consider it true. Let's start with the first. Now let's calculate the arithmetic mean of the deviations from the mean. We calculate 18 minus 8 because we have a negative deviation minus 15 plus 8, minus 9, plus 6. And now we divide all by the number of measurements, which is 6 in our example. And the result is, of course, 0, which is clearly not the standard deviation. Why is it always 0? Because for every value above the mean, there's some amount balancing it below the mean. The positive and negative deviations cancel each other out. So the average deviation from the mean in this form will always be zero. So under these considerations, the statement is obviously wrong. But why did I argue that it is true? Okay, there are different kinds of means. For example, there is the arithmetic mean and the quadratic mean. And yes, I admit, when we talk about the mean, we are generally referring to the arithmetic mean. But nevertheless, the quadratic mean, also called the root mean square, is also a kind of mean. And the standard deviation is exactly the quadratic mean of the deviations from the mean. So if we insert for x the deviations from the mean, we have exactly the standard deviation formula. More precisely, the population standard deviation. Therefore, the statement that the standard deviation is the arithmetic mean of the deviations from the mean is wrong. But the statement that the standard deviation is the quadratic mean of the deviations from the mean is true. So what do you think? Is this statement, the standard deviation is the mean of the deviations from the mean now true or false? Okay, two final points. Number one, I hope you enjoyed the video and that it gave you something to think about. And number two, the next video will be either about why there are two slightly different formulas for the standard deviation or about what the standard error is and what the differences to the standard deviation are. Let me know in the comments which one you prefer.